Okay, today is science experiment today. We are gonna do a little experiment to talk about what happens to gas when it sits in your carburetor, in your fuel pump, or in your fuel tank. So we've got a little pretend gas tank here. We're gonna put some fuel in this and um, leave it out and just see what happens. So we're putting our fuel in. Come on, fuel. Er, come on, left hand, there we go. Putting our fuel in, putting our cap on. We've got some holes in there. And we're just gonna leave it out for a few days and see what happens. So stay tuned. Okay, so science experiment day two and we're already seeing our fuel is evaporating a little bit, oxidizing and changing color. Okay, science project day four, our little uh, pretend fuel tank was actually indoors over the weekend. It was kind of like taking your mill in, inside. Um, but now it's outside again today. Hot, sunny this afternoon. And if you look, the the uh, we're got, it's still yellow. It's gotten a little more yellow. But the other thing that started to happen, hold on. Look at the sky for a minute. I don't know if you can see this, but there's a film that started to form on the bottom of our little container here. And that's interesting. That's part of what we're maybe gonna discover. Okay, guys, I don't even know what day of the science experiment it is at this point, but it's super hot. This has been sitting outside now for off and on for a, almost a week. Um, and as you can see now, we a lot of our fuel has evaporated and what's left in here is extremely viscous and you can see on the bottom there that sticky layer that's there um, and keep in mind it's 100 degrees right now so this is as liquid as it can be if it were 40 degrees 50 degrees 60 degrees this would be that much more solid so this is what's happening in your carburetor after a week if you're not running your machine or if you don't have um, additive in there that's your carburetor and you, if you do that repeatedly that's what happens is that sticky stuff is going to build up in your carburetor we're going to keep looking at it over the next few days thanks hello timber kingdom science experiment little more than a week look at this thing this is your carburetor or your fuel pump or your fuel filter after about a little more than a week of evaporation in high heat like we're having now, 100 degrees. This is as liquid as it gets. Ugh, it smells like turpentine or kerosene. Just look in there. It's just, I'm feeling it. It's super sticky and gummy. That's what happens in your fuel system with evaporation. If you don't use your machine, if you don't run your machine, and when you do that, when you run your machine intermittently, so you run it, leave it, evaporation, that happens in your fuel system. Then you run it, leave it, evaporation, it happens again, and the cumulative effects can be very bad. 